Just because your city is in no. the front does not, not mean, mean you will get picked. You hear that bass drop? I do. It's Jared and Sable. Oh. What's going on, guys? My name is Jared. And I'm Sable. And today we have Chelsea back on the again. channel again. Say hi, Chelsea. Hi. Did you miss me? <laughs> yes, we yes, did. We did. <laughs> I missed you, even though you're with us all the time, even in spirit. <laughs> in spirit, spirit. <laughs> you're with us all the time. So today we have a special story time. Yes, today we are going to tell you about the time that me and Jared were on Let's Make a Deal. know what let's make a deal is it is a game show here in America yes. where basically you have to go up and you dress up in costumes it's actually really fun because yeah. you get to dress up in costumes <laughs> and anytime that Halloween is every day is a fun time yeah. so you go to this the show and if they call you up they basically ask you to guess the the Price, price of things. The price of <laughs> okay. Things. The I couldn't think about it. Okay. There are three you doors guess, that you yeah. can just guess the, what it's price is in things, those doors. You can pick There's like if you want boxes. a big box, right? All of it's that. It's just something. It's, it's a game, game show. Game show. <laughs> so at this game show, one of our friends, Cassandra. Hi, Cassandra. I, I, <laughs> one Hi, of our watching friends, this. One of our friends, Cassandra, invited us to go to the game show. Now, I had been to the game show already three times before. And those I three had times, never been. Yeah, Sable never went. So those three times, I never won anything. So I was like, I kind of got disappointed. And I was like, I don't want to come back to this. Because it's literally, it takes your yeah. whole day. It's literally, And I warned I her. wanted to go because I had never been. So I was exactly. like, this, this is, seems like a fun experience. So why exactly. not? Exactly. So I was basically telling her, listen, if I, be warned. Mm -hmm. I'm going to support my friend. Like, she wants to go on this game show. But, like, if you come, just know. It's literally a cult. You what? are. Wait, yeah. wait, wait. I, I didn't. I didn't believe. Oh what? I, I know. Didn't, it's I didn't good. believe Quit. him. I, I thought I was. I thought he was just joking. Like oh okay. wait, wait. He's just oh what? Uh, <laughs> right. Cult. A cult. Well, we're gonna get into it. like yes. she soon finds out. Oh my god. So basically, it all starts with us arriving at the actual studio. So we yes. thought that that was the studio. We all came <laughs> coordinated. I was a fawn, like a, a fawn fa uh, flower princess. And Ooh. we're gonna insert. Well, we were both like I was like a fawn. Well, no. No, you were, I was a forest sprite, and yeah, we all had like a flower theme going cute. on, so yeah, it was really cool. I had like a sunflower. We're going to insert a picture mm -hmm. right here so you guys can see what we were wearing. <laughs> but I'm telling you, from the moment that we got there, I felt, because, okay, here's the thing. When I went those yeah. other three times, by the way, I forgot to mention this, it was in a different location. So this was a totally new uh, location that I've been to, new production, new everything. So new people, like, I didn't know the ropes. So before where I thought it was, uh, mm -hmm. like, culty and long and crazy, this time it, it was, got like, cult -ish it was dog. more. Yeah. <laughs> like, with it, it was more. So we get there, and we're in our costumes. We sign in, everything, and we proceed to move into the line. The line. Explain. <laughs> Once we the got line. into the line, everyone was lined up, and we basically had to fill out our forms. And everyone, everyone seemed pretty normal and nice until this yeah. woman came up to me, and she started grabbing my Wait. waist. Ugh. Yeah, no. yeah. This woman, you can't just she grab was, on she random was, She people. was like this old woman. She was like a, at least 90 <laughs> she, years old. <laughs> she, no, she, she was <laughs> like more like 100,000. Yes. But well, it was, was like, <laughs> I know. No, but she, she was dressed up as a flapper. So like, like a, well, what is a flapper? Because it's kind of like, because I don't 20s. really know. Like from the 20s. Like, 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 like It's like the the lady like who brings like out the drinks. Yeah, like dance. In the 20s and stuff. And she had like, it was actually a really cool costume, by the way. Yeah, it was cool. It had like foam. She had like, she made these beer glasses where the foam was literally in it was ah. not real but it was like actually mm -hmm. in air it was weird how yeah. she did it but it was it really was pretty cool, cool so she went up to sable she started like touching on my <laughs> waist she was like eh, yeah, no. yeah, yeah. what i was like wait, oh. wait what i just kind of let her do it because i was just kind of like is this happening right That's now how she was talking yes. yeah you, and then like <laughs> and now she was like what? you know in my day no <laughs> you know why of course that's what me and i was like uh-huh because I, I didn't really understand her like i only understood that part well what? it was funny well, it's funny because Sable and Cassandra were actually, she was talking to Sable and Cassandra. I yeah. was kind of standing off to the side, but like I was watching it go down. So after she yes. left, I was like, oh, what was she talking about? And they were like, yeah. we, don't we don't know. know. <laughs> she was just, yeah, she was just crazy. rambling on and just, eh, eh, huh? eh, eh, eh. 
Oh, it's the wit. Oh, okay. I well, yes. basically, <laughs> there you never know. You, you know? never know who you're gonna meet at. Let's make a deal. Let's just yeah. that thought. You never know who you're gonna meet at. Let's you make a deal. Know. Her costume was awesome. There was actually really cool costumes there. A we lot were like of fire cool people. Ones. There was like all types Two of peas in a pie. Like, oh yeah, that oh, was really was so cool. Cute. The cactus one was bun the, in the oven. The bun in the oven. Oh, that's and cute. they ended up getting picked, of course, because like yeah. marriage and all that cool stuff. <laughs> <laughs> but it's like, okay, so after that, we were in the line, right? And then from there, they were like, okay, we're going to take and confiscate your cell phones. And we're like, what? what, what, what? The cell phone is what? my wife. Yeah. You, you they don't... were rounding up people's phones? Yeah, they were. And actually, that was a red flag to me. Because the last time I went, you were able to take your phone into like, the that's studio. Weird. And this time, they were like, let's take that's your cell phone. That's a safety issue. Yeah, yeah, no, it really was because well, that's what people were saying. They were like, "What do I need to call somebody to yeah, that?" Yeah, you know me, I'm paranoid, so like, yeah. I was just like, "Oh, I need a phone." <laughs> so they basically bundled up everyone's cell phone in the thing, and then from there, they were like, "Everybody outside!" Like what? what? But before they did they that, they gave us because, numbers. They gave right, us they numbers. gave us numbers because <laughs> they were like, "Well, They're it right. didn't happen so quick yeah. like that." There's something else that happened before, but they were telling like, "Okay, after you leave here, you guys are going outside." We, but we didn't know what for. But mm -hmm. first, they gave us our name tags, and then they processed us into this other area where we had to basically do the interview yes. segment. Mm -hmm. Because how the game show kind of works is like they kind of the producers will interview everyone in a circle and then pick the people that are going to be on the game show before right. so it's kind of scripted but they just kind of tell they tell you beforehand mm -hmm. so they want to see if somebody has energy if somebody would be a good fit for personality and all these other things so when we were doing the interview of course you know me i'm like crazy whatever mm -hmm. i have energy like natural all yes. day all day long mm -hmm. so the girl had like the most energy out of our group we were just you know Vibing the, yeah. we could tell like the producer actually like really liked really us. Really liked like, us. Oh, this is, and she yeah, was really cool. Hit. And she <laughs> she was like, <laughs> like she was really yeah, into, like, and that was also oh, a red flag because it was like, almost like a but but she yeah. was nice but it was almost it was like, like this like weird. It was like hi. Uh huh. Wow. Yeah. Uh huh. So everyone in the circle that because it was group interviews because there's too many people to like individually interview so they were like oh yeah you're gonna get picked oh you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna oh my god and I low key I was just kind of like yeah I probably am but ah! like you know but I didn't but I was, like, hoping, you know, I was hoping at least one of us got picked you would know get me picked. Sandra or, or Jared. yeah like I was hoping because in numbers there's a power in numbers so like basically in my mind I'm like okay if it's the three of us and yeah. we're together and we're wearing yeah. like these amazing one of us at yeah. least yes, one of us has amazing to get costumes like floral costumes and things like this and very original by the way and it's like they were gonna see that it wasn't like a store-bought thing and they were gonna see that and pick one of us mm -hmm. and then you know we could split the money or the cars right, or the trips right. or the whatever it was so basically we had amazing energy and they seemed like they liked us and whatnot and they went around and did the interviews but then after the interviews <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Everybody outside! Everybody outside! We're like, whoa, 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 wait, wait, I have to gather my things. <laughs> like, we're kind of like, okay. Wait, they, no, they told us. Line up in number four order. Numerical order. Oh, yeah, that's exactly what was No, when I tell you there was no. literally 600 people, I was, we were at the end you of the guys? line, so I was 600 like. 600 people? Yes, I was yep. like number no. 591. And so, no. basically, yes. you, what, okay, so it was, it kind of felt, I've never been to jail before, but in my mind. That's what it, I felt like that because like processing you right like, and we all had our because we had two names that's tags. weird you had basically crazy. on your like, left on your left side you had your name yes. and then on this side You're you had your number, number. Yeah. you had your number no. it was like a yellow badge they, they would be calling you like one through 105 yeah. no, that's get weird. to processing oh, no. <laughs> It, does, it, it is really jail. was. It really was. And then they made us like stand in front of like these green screens and mm -hmm. take pictures. And if they didn't like it, they're like, go back. And it's like, they oh. Liked, they liked ours oh, because, of God. course, we have just like so much they energy. They made people but, go back. But, oh, yeah. Yes, they were making they were. people definitely they go were. back. Because some guys, like, they, like if they, some. If they didn't approve of your outfit or if they didn't like your costume, you had to like actually buy. Go buy and rent. Yes. Okay, that's another they thing. They made you pay yeah, for it. That's another thing. Okay, so if, say <laughs> you came, because a lot of people were from like out of town, other mm. countries, and they wanted to kind of see like the Hollywood mm. lifestyle, LA lifestyle. I want to go on a game show, right. And so they just wore regular clothing because 
who no one really thinks like oh exactly. they just want to experience it right so they literally told those people listen you don't have a costume not only are you having a less chance to get picked and you have to sit to the back of the bus what? you have to actually go and rent costumes they weren't even going to give you so costumes crazy. Back. i thought that was really crazy yeah. you, you have to like, pay for them i was you just have like, to pay for it wow so yeah so it was like i mean some <laughs> other crazy stuff happened in between but we're just going to jump right on to this uh going outside uh part yes. because that's when stuff really starts to get really weird you guys so everybody, everybody outside, numbers one through ten. Oh one ten yes. through. No. And I was just like, <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh, and so we're then, outside. It's like at least one hundred and ten. I, I one hundred and twenty million. Was, yes. Degrees. It was no. I, I think it was one hundred and sixteen. It was at least one hundred million. That day. <laughs> it was so hot. Like I swear to you. So we were hot. standing out there for so long, and That's then so they, long. they had they had big shuttle buses, and we were like, so, "Where are these buses?" Right. No. Well, because okay, because when I originally yeah. went, you guys, you just everybody, you stand outside, mm -hmm. you just sign in your thing, and then you went into the studio. You had your like, phone normal. and everything, and then on TV they would pick you on the spot mm -hmm. if they liked you like oh come up come up come up this was very like manufactured and I was just it was mind-boggling like, because I was just like what are those buses doing and why Where are, are they taking us? why are right. our phones they took, phone. yes. they took our, our phone. phones before then, you got yes. on a bus wait why and, are they but, but our then phones? were you also thinking like why would they have us come to this location yeah. which was a and huge location by the way yeah and it was, was a, it, was it wasn't like a small building where it was like oh the show is obviously not here it was a massive building the first building that we were in that so I was like the crazy. show has to be here no get on a bus everything very small two by two rows and then they're like if you have a disability then you may not sit in the first what? two rows yes they did you go go to the back okay. numbers what? 10 through and so are you yeah, getting no. off of the yeah, bus yeah I feel like usually they have like um people in the disabled front. people helping in the front. yeah or, like, like, right and so basically what? yeah no so we all getting on the bus and everything and I'm sitting next to Cassandra and Sable's is sitting behind us because yes. it's literally two by two it's like mm -hmm. four people across two mm -hmm. by two so Sable's behind us and she's talking to some other person that was in there and he thought it was kind of weird too that mm -hmm. was like right. oh I've never done this like, before like we made friends there yeah we basically made friends everybody was really Really cool yeah. but kind of confused, confused because we're like where are we going they didn't tell us where they were taking they us didn't tell us they didn't tell us they map. were taking us anywhere right and it was like very tinted so it was kind of hazy you could barely really see what was going on you were just in these buses and i That's was making scary. jokes like oh this is like the time that we took the buses mm -hmm. to mountain mountain big bear things yeah. like that like we were just trying to keep our cool yeah. Keep our cool. That's what you like, do. You don't have information. You just gotta. Yeah, I was just positive. kind of like, please, please, yes. please, do not let them take us somewhere and just like, <laughs> if never be seen again. seen again. You know what I mean? That's what I'm saying. Before they could have taken your phones when you already got to the location. It's weird. That's that what they, I was thinking. You can't yeah. tell someone, hey, I'm going to this new location, like yeah, just they, in case. Like, right. Is this a part no, of the social experiment? No, you can't what do is that. that. You know what? Okay. No. No. Oh my that's God. What I was thinking. It might be. kind of like how if I don't know if you. And you guys have seen Wayward Pines on Hulu. It's really good, by the way. And this it is. is not sponsored. It's just a really good show. Um, <laughs> basically, it was kind of in that realm where it was a psychological, like, like a dystopia. you didn't know what to think. Right, a dystopia. Yeah. That's the perfect word. Because you had to Hunger be happy. Games. You knew you had to be happy. Because I'm, I'm not one. I'm not really negative. So mm -hmm. even though I had kind of some thoughts, I was just like, let me just keep my cool. Like, it's all in my mm -hmm. mind. Da, da, da. <laughs> but nobody, I'm telling you yeah. guys, the producer said nothing. Like, get on the bus. Do numbers. No, no, no. I know. It was so, very abrupt. Different too. And how long did it take? Because we, it was just driving all different types yeah, of turns, we and were, we were trying to, like, we were talking we were on the bus. We were in there for a long time. Yeah, we were talking on the bus, kind of like, are they going to get on the freeway? Where are they going to go? Because we were driving yeah. a long, yeah, it was a long time. And, like, the bus driver, I remember somebody was like, Bus driver, bus driver, where are you taking us? <laughs> And he. Mm, oh my god. They didn't no. have on the air. They didn't no. have on the air. They, no air whatsoever. That's dangerous. You're like, oh, I'm doing the you bounce. Can get the bus, sick. It, it was also bouncing. So, mm, you could get sick the or whole something. time. And like, it was kind of. Yeah, it, they didn't have on the air and it was very hot. Oh and like, god. it was just. Oh my god. Good, you got like it was like so we finally arrived at the mysterious location and the moment that i stepped off the bus i kid you not so this woman <laughs> who had really nice hair by the way really cool finger like waves. finger waves mm. she was giving she, us candy on the bus yeah <laughs> oh yeah she did give us candy on the bus yeah. that's another thing so yeah everybody was actually really nice because mm -hmm. we were kind of like working together it was kind of like lost like let's just work together to figure yeah this thing out, you exactly. know what i mean Dystopian. so she brought food but i didn't know before that you could bring like food and snacks but she like smuggled them in you know and <laughs> 
so <laughs> she really did. Like she pulled him out of her bosom. <laughs> Ugh, bosom. Okay, so like, yeah, and, the, and this plays a part in the story because I knew she was a freak. And let me tell you why. The moment that I stepped off the bus, <laughs> she gets a hurt. She takes her hand and pow on my butt. And I'm what? like, Ooh. no, no. I tense no. up. And then she started squeezing what? and she's like, I just wanted to take a feel. No. And then, but when I looked at her, because I was in shock, no. like, I, I was in shock. I was like, oh, I was just and this was like a 45 year old woman, but she looked really young. And because she told us that later on, like, all that stuff. But, like, so, and yeah, well, After that, she yeah. Touched well, because there's a, I'm telling you, this story is so all over the place. So basically, I turned around, but I wasn't angry at her, but I was just like in awe. And so she was like, I thought she, she sensed that I was angry, so she was just like, oh, I'm I'm sorry. I am so sorry. I did not mean to do that. Oh, I'm, oh my God. Like, she oh my God. Like, herself. I will give you. I like. What do you need, dollars? I'm like, girl, you don't even have your purse. But yeah, <laughs> like if you, you know what I mean. But she was like, I was like, it's not even a big deal. I'm not bad. She's like, okay, 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 okay. So I was like, okay. So Sable gets off. Cassandra gets off. Everyone we're, we're all getting off. off. Yeah, and we, get off we basically bus. we're in this like waiting area, like in the front of the it's studio. It's essentially like a tent in front of this mm. huge building, which we later found out was like yes. an abandoned bank. There was Don't barely what? there was they barely moved your location <laughs> to a tent. It was <laughs> weird. <laughs> there was barely any shade at all, but there was like a. Uh, there was like a little coffee stand. Okay, there. wait, let me explain like, this what? for a second because that's the part that really got me. It was this tent outside. It was like 120 million degrees. <laughs> and then they had power out there and a little coffee stand They're with so scenes. Crazy. They also had a medic, but I'm like, why couldn't you guys get us like free water? No water. What? You had a medic, wait, but no water. There was water. a medic on, on, yeah, <laughs> on yes, call. And on I was call. just like, so it's so, like if somebody passed out, no, you need water. You should provide them with yeah. water so that doesn't happen. Like, it's like we're coming we up to the show. We could have at least gotten water or maybe like fruit or something. It's something so, to, the guy who I was talking to, he goes up and he asks the guy from the, the coffee guy that stand. you were sitting, yeah, the guy that she was sitting next to on the bus, what was like, you got, you guys look like, like, cause he was sweating too. Yeah. Like, and yeah. he was. I had I had a bottle of water with me. Yeah. He was, he was. He asked the guy from the coffee stand, "Can I have a cup of ice?" And the guy was like, "I'm sorry, you can't have any ice. This is for my stuff." Oh yeah. This. What? this what? No. He. Let me tell. He didn't say it that nice. He was like. Ooh. He said. No. This is for my blender. This what? is for blended I know it. only. I, I am not giving you ice. And, he looked at and that's what? it. And that's it. You the woman, the woman it. who hit Jared's butt. Listen, yeah. oh. the woman who hit Jared's butt was asking how much is the water, and like we look at the sign, the and the sign. water is five dollars. No, I this would not be. And it, it, let me tell you, and let me tell you guys enough. another reason why we knew it was a scam mm -hmm. because it wasn't even like a store that we were in or like a physical sign. It was like you can tell that they took some piece of paper and just wrote it out like the prices, no, and we're just no. like yes, and hung it out like it was just a makeshift. They were just what trying to get some doing? weird. Money. So I was freaking out already. Ready, but I didn't show it. I was just trying yeah. to keep it. They didn't have any. Centered. They didn't have enough seats for everyone to sit, so we were standing, standing. up in Wait, the what? heat. It was just. It we're standing gross. in the heat. Yeah. And a lot of people were like kind of packed in this one corner. Yeah. Like sardines. If we, if there was like lost, this alley. <laughs> but but remember when the the producers they were standing to the side and if we walked in a certain place they would tell us. Ah uh, no, 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 no! Don't walk over there. Don't walk over there. No 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 no. And it, yes, was, they did. it was like literally right in the, the open, like where the hallway was. Yeah, and so the, the woman who, the woman, <laughs> the woman who like grabbed my butt, like she, she kind of comes around this corner and she starts like thinking like, I'm getting hungry. We've already been here at this right. point. This is like, so we're telling you guys like, we're like skipping a lot of parts because mm -hmm. a lot of it was just long, like a lot of waiting. And by this point it was about, we're four hours in. Yeah, we were, four I mean, hours we, of, we like, were waiting in. out there, standing in the heat for at least And an very hour. hungry. And dehydrated, so the girl kind of eyeballs like a, was it a Del Taco in the yeah, or something? There was and, a Del she, Taco. They start, and people started talking like, "Oh, could we make a run for we it?" Were this crazy. Crazy. We were trying. You guys to... are actually in jail. Yeah. You have to. <laughs> we no, were no, trying to just go. We were trying to sneak away to Del Taco. Yeah, speaking of jail, the producers talk. caught us. Speaking of no, jail, they yeah, caught no, but, you. Well, before because oh yeah, God. well, there was barbed wire around the fence. So that you couldn't get out. Basically. This is not real. But this here's place the thing. is not real. And right, and the, here's the thing. They they made it so that you felt like you had freedom, but they wouldn't let nope. you leave. So the reason why we saw the Del Taco is because the gate was wide open. Someone was. We tried walking, walking over there, but they there. wouldn't let. The, the gate was wide open. Three producers, literally, ba band together, linked on. Look, 
like this. No. No, nope. human barricade, nope. you, you are not go going nowhere. No, no freedom. And they're not we're even thirsty. We, we told them, we're thirsty. We're thirsty. My, hot, my water at this point is super hot. Yeah, she got a little hot. water bottle, and I, and I was just trying to drink it. And it was literally, I don't know what it was about that day, but it was so hot that the water in her bottle literally heated. It felt like soup when I was drinking it, but I just we needed something. We could taste the plastic melting. The melting in it. Like, we basically That's were poisoning insane. ourselves. And... Anytime you would say, can I just please, uh, and I, I That's just, um, crazy. They would just point yep. to the sign. <laughs> yep. The fake sign, by the way, that they just wrote and made. It was just, yeah. They would point to the sign. <laughs> oh they would just point God. to the sign. Point to the sign. And so by You're this trapped. point, it was just like, oh Every my God. Every 30 minutes to a producer would come outside and talk to the, the group and tell them, do not look at the camera. Well, and like just. Well, it was a yeah. different... Okay, because, like, what she's talking about is that thing I said before, because there was two sections. Yeah. We were kind of near this weird makeshift, the like, kiosk. N the kiosk. Stand, stand where the drinks were that you have to pay for. <laughs> and then the... The Most of the were people sitting. were kind of jammed in like sardines yes. in this little like Tank. nook and cranny yeah. area on the side, but it was still in the like heat. So the producers would come out and talk to them and like Cassandra would go over there to see like what they were talking right. about because it was directly in the sun yeah. and we were just we were like, dying. Cassandra, we're not yeah, going please. over there in the heat. Yeah. I'm sorry, you can stand there. Tell right. us what happened. Thank and you, she was Cassandra. updating <laughs> us on it. So she went over there to like find out and everything. And but and then but I went for part of the conversation and they were so yeah. loud anyway, you could, you could hear, hear them because it wasn't in separate areas. We it was like an L shape, so yeah. like the thing would be on one side, and then the yeah, the, the alley was the on L. the other side. Like, yeah. but it was all crammed. So the producer would come out and literally give instructions. Like, what was one of the instructions? Like about the costume. Do not look at the camera. Oh yeah. Do not. If look you at see the camera. Wayne Brady right. and you're up there, do not touch him at all. Do, do not, not touch, touch him. Ugh. Do not make do not eye contact unless we him. tell you to. Unless we tell no. you to say another thing was like example the costume thing. It's like okay, so yeah. how we had our costumes on it said if you get picked and you go up there, make sure you do not say what you are. So for example, if you were like Pikachu or something, you couldn't say, Oh, I'm Pikachu if they actually you say No, yeah. you have to say I'm a yellow cat. Like no. I you you must what? not go up there. No. You know, if you are Heinz ketchup, no, I am a red bottle of something that is <laughs> of something sauce. of yes. sauce. It had, yeah, it had to be no. very, very generic, which proved very difficult for some people because literally some people were literally like Felix the Cat, like really yeah. obvious stuff. And and that's another thing, like if they, they were like, your chances are lessened oh if you God. are wearing a copyright costume because that's copyright and da da da, -da, -da. He also, he was like, and if you don't have any energy, you better get some. You better like, get some. We're but in the heat where it's hot. Five, five hours at this point. Four to five hours, we're drained, we're dehydrated, we're hungry, we're already eyeballing Del Tacos, and, and we're trying to they make a run for They starve you it. out, and then they There's expect no you to be energetic. Way. Well, because we were going to send, what happened was, she was going to nominate, the girl who was the first eyeballed the Del Taco, mm -hmm. who touched my butt, she nominated herself. She was like, maybe Sacrifice I can make a run size. for it, and then bring everybody back food. But the problem was, she didn't have her purse, so it was like, how were, even if you yep. did get out, like, how were you going to buy your your stuff? So it was just- she would tell I was held captive. I right. need food. I need it was so ridiculous. Like you're supposed to feed your people. Or at least water. You can people will pass out. You yeah. can't yeah. do that to yeah. people. Yeah, I was literally almost passing out. And actually that's another thing. Someone came like the one of the producers came out and was just kind of like Alright, pretty soon we're gonna no. start letting people in. And when we do, we're gonna call the handicapped people first. If you have special needs and you can't walk upstairs then you must go this way. Oh and enter through like this secret door and literally this group of people who didn't even could, they could yeah. walk upstairs, they, they went they, with they him. They literally, they because they were right next to us. they were so us, hot. They were just like, you know what, we're going. We're going, like let's go. Like we're gonna tell <laughs> them we can't walk go. upstairs. Yeah. And they went into a door and we actually didn't see them again after that. No, and which is, no it's no. the truth, we really we didn't. We never saw them. Yeah, we really they didn't. Were like, cool. They weren't even, Black they home. weren't. And we talked no. to them the whole time. I even took a picture with for them. Remember I took a picture for them before? Cause they were like, Jared, cause we had our name text they knew my name. Yeah, it was, and, a group. It was yeah. an ALS group. Yeah, it was ALS, like, so yes. they did like sign language yes. and stuff, and they did have uh, different interpreters right. with them, and they did, mm -hmm. say, they were like, Jared, can you take a picture of us? I was like, I'm more yes. than happy to right. and everything. They were so nice, like, <laughs> but we never saw them, them again. And we they, didn't even see them in the audience. That I don't was know where the they crazy went. thing. And <laughs> partly, and, okay, they did like an alternate world. Well, <laughs> and I'm scared because they, they didn't have their costumes on, so I feel like they broke a rule and then they got oh, rid of them. Yeah. I don't know what to think. Hunger Games, like, eliminated. Yes. Yes, into yes, the forest. yes, yes, Katniss is very shook. <laughs> <laughs> so now, they called us to go in. 
it was our time. <laughs> Finally, after an hour and a half of waiting, it was time to go yeah, in. It was. <laughs> At this moment, I contemplated my life. <laughs> oh my. Oh. Did you? Yeah. I didn't know what I would have cried to expect <laughs> in there. They drained us of all of our energy. I'm tearing up just thinking about it. Honestly, it is really We crazy. were dehydrated. We were tired. Hot. Tired. But our costume. I started my period. <laughs> <laughs> the stress yeah. of just being out there. Really? Really? Yeah, yeah. It was very metallic in there. <laughs> <laughs> Did it smell like pennies? <laughs> <laughs> More like screwdrivers. <laughs> So, and yeah, it was definitely our time. So at this moment, the producers came out. Several producers came out. It wasn't because they would come out of the door here and there, but this time it was many, <laughs> many producers. Oh, and actually before that, <laughs> there were some, I guess, because, okay, here's the thing about this show, Let's Make a Deal. They film all day. It's literally oh a factory. God. So as we were standing out there, we were seeing people like escape mm -hmm. from the side. Yeah. And I call it escape because they looked like... <laughs> ready, yeah. I'm ready to go. They were, yeah, they yeah. were like, when they came out on the sides, just really frantic and they went out the <laughs> Oh gate. my God, so, so they even have the people working their captive. They're all right. captive. Well, the people, well, no, these were some people, I guess, from a previous show, yeah. contestants. It was, no, they had the winners too. The winners, yeah. It was like some type of winner circle or something that was coming out on the side so where we were where kind of like that coffee stand was or whatever yeah. they almost they were coming out but they almost seemed like they were like something happened to them in there oh and the producers who was walking behind them literally said don't talk no. to them yeah. don't talk to them what they did at all <laughs> and so they were going in a line but there was so no. many coming mm -hmm. out that we started to follow them because we thought that we didn't, we couldn't tell. They had on costumes, we had on costumes. Right. We didn't know, we thought they were one of us. Yeah. So, we started to follow them, and then they once again linked oh, arms. Oh my yep. god. At the gate. No. They're getting on a different bus than you guys. <laughs> no. <laughs> They're crazy. Yeah. They're actually crazy. Only, we weren't getting on a bus. <laughs> we were going into the building. <sighs> so. They open the doors <laughs> and we start to walk. And this is the part that I noticed that this was in an old abandoned bank. There was a clock tower and a sign that <laughs> literally yeah. said, yeah, I looked up, yeah. No, because I literally called it out to the group. I was like, this isn't a bank? And one girl in the back said, what? Because oh. she saw it. The, oh, yeah. No, we were like, what type of walking Illuminati? Through, is yeah. It? it was so <laughs> weird. And so as we were, because you're walking through these corridors. We're still outside at this point. Yeah. It was a door, but we were still outside. It was so weird. Mm. We walked through, and the first thing we see to the right is an office, like a producer's office, mm -hmm. but the lights are off. No one's in there. Papers are scattered everywhere. Oh Remember? God. And then on the wall, it said, like, smile, you're on camera. Okay, stop, like, with a little right. smiley face. They kept posting post-it notes everywhere. Smile, you're on camera. So I was just going to learn. Well, you remember why they, set, they have the sign there, though, because when we were talking to the producer at the other building, she said... This is where it begins. Yeah. Oh, I, so, yeah. As soon as she said, it begins now. Oh, my. This is Hunger Games. It really is. With the costumes yeah. it really and everything. Is. So we're walking through these corridors, and we finally, because we're basically, it's a lot of us. So we're not walking. We're literally, it's like a stop and go yeah. type thing. So we have time to actually look into the building while we're, out, we're standing. We're, we're still outside. We're still outside We're still in the heat, point. and we're just like, oh my God, right. we're and in so direct we see, sunlight right exactly. now. Exactly. So, so finally we started to move mm -hmm. more into the building. Finally we actually get in the building. Mm -hmm. And the first thing that we see like in the building, there's like different things on the walls, whatever. And there's like some like a custodian in there yes. with like a thing, but remember no, him? The custodian, he was like, there was like another hallway. I remember that hallway. There. So he was mm -hmm. kind of like blocking that in the elevator. Well, the elevator, yes. yes, I'm so glad you said that. Because the elevator looked like it didn't work. It looked, everything <laughs> looked fake. Because he never got on it's it. He just universe. stood there yes. with it and just was looking yeah, at it yeah, in the whole time. It was just like this. Mm hmm. <laughs> like he's seen it's this like, all what? before. No! Right. You guys are next. Oh my God. You guys are next. Yes, I'm telling you guys. <gasps> and then 
it was time to walk up the stairs. The stairs. I don't want to walk up the stairs. Oh, and before this, <laughs> before this, I forgot to mention, before that, remember, yes. we were going through and we As were seeing we, other... We actually got into the studio. Into the studio, you could see the prizes. So, mm -hmm. cars, boats, then weird Everything. giant couches. The zonks. The zonks. Zonks, and like yeah. weird like smoke effects and weird <laughs> things that were in there it was it was like you were seeing into this weird thing like what are we about the to chamber endure chamber of secrets mm -hmm. plants and then there was animals. also blinds where like the producers were behind but they were thick blinds so you couldn't really hear but we were peeking through me and Jared because you know <laughs> mm -hmm. we're very nosy yes we so, are so and they were just <laughs> <laughs> and then, oh like, yeah, that is. And then no. you saw one like come through because we no, kept Chelsea. opening it. Chelsea, no. that is what ha I'm thinking now. Like I'm actually thinking about that part because what what they had us walking through wasn't an actual hallway. It yeah. just looked like one. It seems it, so, it seemed as right. if the, the it was a sheet and yes. they were this behind is a it. So world. It seemed as if um, Wayne Brady and his um, co-host were not even in that area. Like they were underground. Well, because if you, because I remember brushing up against it and then a hand through no, the thing pushed no. me off of the like curtain. He pushed off of it. Jared. They pushed you off. Like get off the this curtain. This is not a real world. So we're walking up the stairs <laughs> in the studio. And I'm like with me, it's me, Cassandra, Sable, like everyone we had met in line. And we're just looking around, whatever. And then I start to like yeah. feel like the yeah. walls. Like <laughs> it's solid. <laughs> what? And we understand that at studios, like it, the walls are usually soundproof, but right. this never. was different. Yeah. This was a thick concrete wall. Okay. No. With pad. No. No. Black they padding. put you in a padded room. And they then know. a cage no. over it. Yeah. With signs uh, all over it. A cage. Mm -hmm. An actual cage. <laughs> we were the cats that's of where the they, day. That's yeah. <laughs> and Jarrett, I remember Jarrett said, this seems cultish. <laughs> and everyone in line was this like, seems oh my like god. Another universe. Yeah, it does. It does. <laughs> and Cassandra, she was the witch of the group on that day. <laughs> and she said, you were right. <laughs> This is a cult. <laughs> and she had no idea no. that it was only beginning. No. It gets worse. Yes. There's a cage. This is just the beginning. This is the beginning of the end. Yep. As soon as we get on the actual stage. <laughs> I'm laughing now, but it's just really crazy. As soon as we get on the actual stage, they line you up in groups. In groups. You have to stand in the middle up on the stairs and the producers are watching you they're just kind of like watching oh and then i remember yeah. one of them <laughs> said they were like um um listen up everybody yeah that was a long pause some of you might get split up some of you might get split Ooh. up because if you're not what we're looking for if you don't have the Ooh. right costume if you, it's cohesive for tv they may not see you together. That's what they said. Yeah. There was a producer um, <laughs> where we were on top of the stairs. And he basically, once the producers who were actually watching us, who were pulling the strings, um, told him where to put us. <laughs> that's when strings. he pulled us to the side and said, come here. And then come he would, here. And he placed and he us. Would place us. Oh, somewhere. and I forgot to say. So basically, that where that cage was in the whole building, we were actually walking upstairs at this point. You went up. And then you had to go down. Nope. So yeah. when we got to the top of the stairs, we were actually on set. The Let's make a deal set. Like, I'll insert a picture right here. We were on the set, but at the top of the stairs. Looking down on the stage were all the producers, fancy mm -hmm. cameras, giant Neon tripods, lights. lights, everything. It was very colorful. Beautiful set, by the way. It was huge. And huge and cold. And they were looking. We saw the woman who interviewed us yeah. at the bottom. And she and did this. No. 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 Remember? No. She, did, she did. Whispering no. to she and said, yeah. She said, they look. Remember. Yeah. Yeah. This is dystopian. And you watch those yes. movies? Yes. That's what they do in these movies. Everyone was. <gasps> no. Like, it was just such a weird environment. Right. No. So the guy got us and he did say, he's like, 
you guys here and I'm so thankful like if you guys are watching this you guys on a cult when well, you really are but I mean <laughs> um thank you so much for seating us together because we were really scared um uh, me Cassandra and Sable like we we needed to I think it's because we had really good energy, <laughs> energy. Like, and our what? costumes are really yeah. amazing and you know we just give off positive energy even in the face of <laughs> <It's> death <crazy. laughs> they sat and us in the front Yes, they did. And, and oh, oh, they sat us in the front and we were like hype. We were like, yes, yes, we were about to get on TV. And literally, as soon as we had that thought, they just could read your mind. They said, no. <laughs> just because your city is no. not does not no. mean you will get picked. They're crazy. We can pick from, from anywhere in the back. On the side. We've already We've decided, decided, decided that we're going to be crazy. crazy. But guess, but guess what? What, 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 what happens sometimes is we'll, is we'll be, be looking, looking at you to come up on TV, TV and if we already hit you, you, you and you're sitting there like this, with no energy, we're moving on to the next. We are moving on to the next. You've missed out on that prize. You're gone. You're dead. You're gone. You're in the cage. You're a goner. And that's exactly what yeah. happened. So once everyone was seated, um, one of the bald producers comes up and he starts a questionnaire session. So he says, does anyone have any questions? If you do, if you have anything mm -hmm. you want to ask any of the producers, please, this is your time to do it. Raise before. your hand and ask, yep. though. <laughs> no, raise your hand. Don't just talk when you're not being spoken to. <laughs> It was yeah. very calculated. So he asked a woman. A woman asked <laughs> really a question, <laughs> and she basically asked, "What is the most common uh, costume that people wear mm -hmm. when they go on the game show?" <sighs> when she asked that, I was just kind of like, "Please, please, please, do not get on this guy's bad side because we've <laughs> already seen enough today." <laughs> I was scared, and she was in a really nice costume, by the way. It was she like was this red and black, like chef. Cause she was really a chef, so it was really cool. Yeah. She just wore like her work outfit, and so she asked that question, and he said, "Hmm," as he tapped his foot. Crazy. Let me think. <laughs> a a nerd. nerd. And then he looked and saw that her son was a nerd. No. And he was like, oh, I mean, oh, I, I mean, I'm sorry, but it. Uh, well, no. it's a basic costume. Oh, it is. It's, an it's easy, easy, easy to put together. It's easy. That's all the most tea, common. All tea, all shade. It's, yeah. All tea, all shade. And they were just kind of like... <laughs> yeah. They were in shock oh. that he even said that as a producer. Like, this is supposed to be like we're having fun. Professional, like, supposed to be, but yeah. also you need to be professional. professional. You can't be throwing shade. Yeah. And the girl in the beginning, so the, the cactuses that we were talking about, mm -hmm. the cactus costumes, she raised her hand. And what did she ask? She asked, what is the most, no, she didn't ask what was the most common. She asked, what, what was, his, was favorite? his favorite costume? Yes, what was his favorite costume? And do you know what he said? Someone came as him, dressed up as He's him. Crazy. With a bald head. They had a bald wig a cap. A bald cap. He's crazy. Yeah, a bald cap. He's, he the, said, king. But, He's, the, He's the king of the But kingdom. they didn't get picked. But that was the best costume. But I might be biased. <laughs> I'm crazy. telling you guys. So when you guys are the thinking of these, like, the ring after leader. that, no one asked any other questions because question. it was just it very was, off like, Really scared. <laughs> well, you guys, like when, so when we're when we're describing these people, I want you to just keep in mind they all have different personalities, but they all had one thing in common that they were yeah. very robotic mm -hmm. and like they would talk to you very much like, yes. Uh-huh, and, and this was world. the best, yes. and this is that. And even the producer in the beginning who interviewed us was like. Make Ooh, sure. I hate that. Hi, I mean that. It was like, whoa. And no, well, it was it was after, more of like a. Yes. Ha, 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 ha. It was One like, thing that we <laughs> forgot to tell you guys is that we were the last interview ease. So we were. So after we she were. was done with our interview, I saw when we were walking um towards the waiting area mm -hmm. that she, when I was looking back, her face went from this to. Oh. <laughs> I kid you not. That's exactly what she did. The robot turned off. It she did. ran out of batteries. Well, because she was the interviewing girl, so she was gonna go back to the building and interview the next batch. The she didn't batch. stay for at, the next show. Right for the next show. Because we were the last for this show. So she, it's weird. She came over, I guess, on a bus as well, just to see us off, and we'll see us before the show starts, and then she went back. What? 
Mm-mm. And we found her Instagram, by the way, too, but we're not going to put it in this video. <laughs> <laughs> and so, and her like... Her bob. <laughs> yeah, she... And, and that's the thing. Everybody was so good looking. Everybody looked really nice. Nobody was, like, looking like they were crazy. So the fact that they were crazy... They knew really? they have an agenda. They know. They know. <laughs> an agenda. Mm -hmm. So... The one thing that I did tell Cassandra and Sable beforehand, because I had been before, I was like, you guys are going to be dancing for 8 to 10 hours. And I like, didn't believe what? him, of course. Yeah, they, she didn't believe me. Nobody believed me. They're like, no, there has to be a downtime, a downtime yeah. when you're sitting down or right. doing something like that. No. We danced the entire we time. We were dancing the entire time. So, so you didn't have breaks? After we no, were the, eight. No, the break was you're dancing. Literally. Yes. So the, you're dancing during oh the show and the break was... After the producer was asking us questions, <laughs> no. we stood up in Taylor Swift, shake it off. They said, came on. Playing. They literally said, everybody rise up. Producers literally just watching, watching us you. behind the cameras. And talking. <laughs> Acting like they were going to pick you, even there though they already did. Oh yeah, there, there was, was microphones on the floor, too. I looked down and I noticed, I said, Microphone. But you couldn't talk. And cameras. Okay, Small you're on cameras. camera the whole time. So even when they said it's a commercial break, the cameras are still rolling. Yes. And they tell you, the cameras are still recording. What? They're Remember, still recording. we're always watching. Always watching. I, so as me and what? Sable and Cassandra are dancing, like we're, I'm talking like, do you guys see the mics down uh, there? Yeah. And I'm like, yeah, <laughs> yeah. I see them. Oh my God. I see them. It's oh kind of like we got kind of in this like... It was like we're doing a ritual or like uh, uh, literally uh, just we dancing, were in a trance. dancing non -stop. We were like in a trance. I don't know if you guys have seen True Blood, like the scene no. with Marianne or like yeah. when they, everyone was we're just, just dancing. dancing. Dancing non-stop. Dancing That's non -stop. What people say. Hey, 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 hey. Yeah. That's what people say. And then Bruno Mars came on. It was non-stop yes. dancing. I I'm I'm not gonna lie, it was pretty fun at first. It was very but fun. then when we continually had to keep doing it over yeah. and over, we got yeah. tired. But then once once we started, like they the producers could tell that we didn't have a lot of energy in us, they would stop the music and they would literally cut it and they said, Remember, whoever got picked. <laughs> There's We're always watching. you're always replaceable. And just because yeah, just because what? we picked you now, you can get replaced. You can get replaced. Put back on the music right now. Dance. Din 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 din. And we're talking the whole time. Hey, <laughs> hey Cassandra, how are you doing? Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, aren't you kind of hot yeah, right now? Like wow, I thought it was cold in here at first. But I told you it was gonna get really hot. It's hot again. We're back to being hot. Yeah, because you had to the whole time. So the show is going on. People are going up, getting picked, getting called, and the whole time they're dangling it over your head. You could be next. So the whole time you had to dance and smile and sing and then the dance contest. The dance contest. Yes. Cassandra was picked for the dance contest. They picked three people. Mm -hmm. Two girls and one guy. And they made them go into the center and dance. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody dance. So they literally did one by one. Now you dance. Da -da 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 -da. You dance. Da -da 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 -da. And the third person dance. Da -da 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 -da. And then the crowd picked the winner. The guy won, and basically his prize was a tote bag that was touched by Wayne Brady. A tote when bag. When everybody else touched was going by up Wayne there Brady. winning boats prizes, 26,000 guessing places and all that. And it's crazy. I knew most of the answers to everything. They didn't pick me not once. And I had my energy the whole time. And I was, I was really, and that's why I promised myself I would never go back to let's make a deal. But I did it anyway. Get in your head. I love my friends and I, I'll do that. It's definitely, it's, they, it was I, fun. What I noticed too is they were picking people who they knew would be nervous on camera or who wouldn't actually They're crazy. Win. Yeah. They're the who would purposely yes. not win because they didn't want to give up the money. That's what I realized. Mm -hmm. They purposely picked Stop. people, yes, who could Stop. not win the they, thing. They, they, they picked this guy who looked like the guy Mind from games. Get Out. Yeah. Mind games. Yeah. The gardener off of Get Out. Yeah. The movie. Yeah. Yeah. And he basically could not, like, they basically 
threw him off on purpose. Now, I felt bad for him because yeah. the other people, they just didn't know. He had three chances he to actually, win huge prizes. Huge a trip prizes. to, where did he? Somewhere, uh, Bora Bora, Bora like, Bora, Bora, Bora. Bora. it was like it was Bora, Bora. A, out of the country trip. And then something They gave else, him another, they gave him another chance. They were like, would you rather take $1,000 or see what's behind Mind door, door number, number one? one. He, he picked the $1,000. Behind door number one was a car. Kia Soul. It was a Kia brand Soul. New Kia brand Soul. new. And the look on his face, he was just like, hmm. I did it again. <laughs> oh. The whole time. So, of course, it's TV. They said, nope, gotta reshoot that part. Oh my god. Make sure, sure you're, you're smiling. smiling. He was literally you can crying. Only, yeah. I was, I felt what? so bad for him. I was you like, can no. only, yeah. They were like, you can only be yeah. down for like a second, then act defeated, and then you have to come back like, oh, well, I'm still happy that I won this money. But come on, a thousand dollars compared to an actual car, yeah. like anyone, you, you're not going to be, yeah. you're gonna be disappointed. That so is that is after, just like after he went back up sta on stage I think the producers took him in took him off of the set because he was that well devastated. he was no he was still sitting there you didn't he turn yes he, he probably was probably just got over we, tur we turned around this. and he was just doing this well because I didn't see well him everybody else I did everybody else was but dancing. I feel like <laughs> because already he lost and then he was like why am I still pretending yeah, yeah, to doing yeah, playing your game? Yeah. I'm not playing so your game. So he just drifted off into yeah, the I, background. I, I literally, just... I didn't see him when we were walking. I was trying to look. I was like, what? <laughs> Where yeah, well, no, because when we left, of... I didn't see him. But yeah, me either, during, so I saw him, out. and he was just sitting there, and I felt so bad oh, because I'm like... the reason why I didn't see him is because they took all the people who were actually picked yeah, to go they take a, a group photo afterwards. Even if you And even if you lost, they were like, even if you lost, you have to come with us. Yeah. And families so that's, families that's of those people who won, yep. you'll meet up with them back at the Stop. beginning. You'll, yeah. you'll be taking a separate bus. Don't worry about them. They have to do paperwork and processing. <laughs> <laughs> so, so after More he processing. had his, his chance to win all of these prizes, yeah. the producers came and then they started throwing Jolly Ranchers at us like chickens. Okay, we went, oh, that part, oh, basically they came out, we were dancing, and they this dude had a bucket, one of the producers had a bucket with candy in it and said, now eat, now eat, who wants no, candy, now no, eat, now eat, no. and was, ah, trying to get it. And then I was like, oh, and I actually think you have two of the Jolly Ranchers still in your purse. I do, because I Because remember, I don't know if you guys remember, like, on the other video, I said, I can't eat Jolly Ranchers. Like, I almost choked and died. Like, I can't. Like, I, it's a story time. If you guys want to hear that story time, let me know in the comments below. I said, it was a long time ago. I love Jolly Ranchers, the flavor, but I can't eat them. So they were throwing out Jolly Ranchers, and I picked it up, like, happy, like, candy, candy, because you just get in the trance. And I saw the Jolly Ranchers, woo! And I, I just like, oh, no, no. And like, yeah, so Sable still has the candy, like. I, yeah, I have two of them, I think Oh my gosh, she flavor. brought them with her, yeah. And I just, <laughs> I couldn't do it. I, I could not do it at all. Now it was time for the big deal of the day. Now what the big deal of the day is, they took basically all the ones who won like the biggest prizes, they pick one person who won the mm. most money. This lady so far, her prize was up to like 14,000 or something. Wow. So yeah, she got picked and she was like a fairy. She went up, or like a cheerleader or yeah, something. I couldn't really tell, but she had like wings. I don't know, it was like cool. But <laughs> yeah, like she went way. up to the front, and basically the big deal of the day, you can't lose on this deal, but you can get a prize less than what you've already won, if that makes sense. So there was mm -hmm. three curtains. You couldn't lose, you couldn't lose though. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. It could be a yeah. car, it could be a giant prize, whatever. Me and the guy who I was sitting next right. to, who I was talking to in the bus, we noticed that like um, the producer was, the producers were switching the prizes from like um, mm. the cars, the cars. whatever. Like you can literally. Yeah. Or the here's zoinks. the thing: you can see behind if it was a zonk, which was yeah. bad. You could see, but you can't get a zonk on the big deal of the day. But you could see if it was a small prize or a little yeah. prize because underneath there was the shadows, mm -hmm. and you can kind of tell in door number one that yeah. they drove in a car. Yeah, we but saw the, them switch it. They were switching. But while they were it. switching oh it, God. they had a producer talking, talking and distracting the, girl, the actual the... contestant, and oh we're like, "Girl, we were trying to tell her, like, look, look, yeah. they're switching the car," he and the producer like was like, in front of her, "The producers like, was yeah, looking at it, like blocking her so that it they could be, so that she couldn't like look," yeah. and she kept. 
like he was telling her things that she probably already knew like oh you have to be energetic you have to be happy yeah, if you oh win something God. good or but he they That's kept saying uh uh look at me eye contact come on come on look at oh. me that's what they kept doing and then so basically her. yeah distracted yeah. her so no. she already had like fourteen thousand dollars like in prizes like a vacation and whatnot mm -hmm. and so when it was yeah. finally her time like to like do the show when brady yeah. came out and was like and his co -host, her, and the co-host the co-host so they were trying to introduce the big deal of the day to like mm -hmm. the, the tv show the audience and everyone and basically the producer who was behind the camera noticed that the co-host wasn't looking happy enough exactly. the co-host was kind of like because everybody was drained which I'm everyone sure he does was drained. he does it all day and <laughs> the producer like cuts it immediately and is like stop 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 yeah and we we're just like what what's going on right, right now Get it together. Get I'm, it just, together. Gonna, I'm just gonna call him Jeff. Get it yeah. together, Jeff. Yeah. And then Wayne what? is looking at him like, Yeah, no. Yeah. And then he goes from this to, Yeah, yeah. And he does his, and mind you guys, mind you, at this point, we were all exhausted. So, what yeah. they did before this, or we didn't, is like. They knew that since yeah. nobody else was getting called up, they shot all the final scenes mm -hmm. that they could edit in after. So that, because at the final scene when the girl was up there for the big deal of the day, we were all just kind of sitting there like yeah. this, like watching. Yeah. Whereas... Yeah, they they, they, they filmed the final a, mm -hmm. dancing scene and like, everything beforehand because beforehand, they knew that they everyone knew. was going to be They're exhausted done. by the end of this. So, they, yeah, they were just like, this is the big deal. And they made you do it. No dance, no dance. Woo! And all this other stuff. Little so puppets. At, <laughs> we, 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 that's what I felt like. I felt like puppets. Oh, my God. And so then, so after the producer thing happened, so it was time for her to pick her big deal. Of course. She didn't choose she door number one. We, we kept number telling three. her. Door number one, Go the first one. one. We were telling her That's we saw the them. We saw the car. And so they showed, oh, this is your prize, which was like a living room set or something. And mm -hmm. it was valued at like, I think like a little bit more than what she had. It was like $15,000. Mm -hmm. But when they did the curtain number one, what was behind there? It was a brand car. new car. I don't, I forgot what kind of car it was, but it was Me brand too. new 2017 car. Husband. Yeah, it was like a really nice car. And mm -hmm. I was just like, oh my God. Like we were trying to tell you, but she had to act like, hey, yeah, yeah. We were, we were <laughs> trying to tell multiple contestants and none of them were listening to us. We were literally right in the front. We, we were in the everything. front. So like basically where the contestants were, if you just listen and use your head voice <laughs> in yeah. the back of your head. The Jimmy Neutron right? think. Yeah, think. like. Yeah. Just, yeah, cause everybody was shouting I out things, the but we were right behind them. We were like, door number two, hello, mm -hmm. we can see the prices yeah. over here. That's probably why they didn't pick us, cause yeah. we could literally they see. But I feel like everyone could see it if you're just looking. If but you're looking, people aren't really that. Up, they don't observe. Yeah, they're not really observant when it comes to stuff like that. And mm -hmm. so, yeah. It was time for us to leave at that point. And after that, literally, as soon as the show was done. No. All the lights went off. You guys stepped into an alternate reality. Yeah, yeah really. we felt colorblind. I no. forgot to tell you, yes, everything was black and white after that. No yeah. more colors. They turned everything off the neon light. Oh my but God. But it wasn't like lighting. It was almost like it was the, the world set was, changed. Everything was gray. It was so weird. I wish I could. It was like the Powerpuff Girls when everything went black and gray. white. It was yeah, yeah. Like everything white. was black and white. Almost like, because I think everything what? was LED panels that were colored. Mm. So it was kind of like once that went off, it was just no color because we were used to seeing all of this color and then the lack of color. And all producers were like, all right. They're going into processing. You'll meet up with their yeah. families, da, da 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 So when we were walking outside um, or out of the building, basically a producer stops me and he goes, Hey, you forgot your water bottle. And oh, I was like, uh. okay. Oh, that okay. was really scary. And I was like, Lord, you should have kind of left that because I don't really They're know. Like, stuff in yeah, I don't, <laughs> I don't really know. Like, <laughs> right. yeah. I, and then so we get out and we get back on the bus and they take us back. And one woman came in there and was like, you guys look like a bunch of people that went to Vegas and didn't win any money. <laughs> and I was just like, well, you were. <laughs> I've never been to Vegas before. But yeah, that basically that's kind of how we were because it was literally like eight to ten, basically exhausting. about ten hours of exhausting stuff. And Everyone was exhausted. We so were tired. all in just terrible moods. We were just like, oh my God, that was... I mean, it was fun. I wasn't in was. a bad mood. I mean, I was everyone, just really you like, tell the people like, oh yeah, on their, well, they like, were, were a lot of people because they didn't want anything. I went on knowing because yeah. I went three times already. Yeah. I didn't expect, so I was just having like a fun time mm -hmm. in the costumes and stuff. But I was hungry. Yeah, I had, I was I had a fun experience. I was it was hot. fun with you and Cassandra. Yeah. 
And overall, it was really fun. And if you liked that yeah. story time and you want to hear more story times from our crazy lives <laughs> and other stuff, because we have tons, especially that Jolly Ranch story time, let me know if you want to hear that because I really did choke and almost <laughs> die. But leave it in the comments below. Give us a big, big thumbs, thumbs up. up and subscribe if you're new. Turn those post bell notifications on. on if you haven't bell already. On now. <laughs> Turn the bell on because you don't want to miss any of our amazing videos. Crazy and antics. Crazy <laughs> antics. And until next time. Hey, you guys. Before we end this video, I want to give a quick shout out to Cyber Ghost. If you guys would like a shout out, please turn on post notifications. You must be subscribed and comment done when you are done in the comment section below. Okay, now back to our regular programming. Peace, Peace love, and abundance of joy.